African leaders gathered at the 35th African Union Summit have condemned the waves of coups seen in Africa. At Sunday's closing session, Kenyan President Uhuru Kenyatta presented a report linking coups to political instability and an absence of good governance that undermine Africa's socio-economic progress. Kenyatta chairs the Peace and Security Council of the African Union. He called on the African Union to address roots of the causes of the coups. The report also addressed ways to curb terror activities and politically motivated conflicts across the continent, including in Ethiopia. Ambassador Pankoli Atiyoye, who is the AU's Commissioner for Political Affairs, Peace and Security, said summit attendees took a firm stance against any unconstitutional change of government in Africa. To underscore the point, the ambassador noted the AU suspended a member of four nations, including Mali, Guinea, Sudan and Burkina Faso. Ambassador Bankoli says the Peace and Security Council is backing efforts to facilitate talks between the Ethiopian government and the Tigray People's Liberation Front, TPLF, while supporting Ethiopia's Commission for National Dialogue. Armed conflict involving the government and TPLF erupted in November 2020.